Hey guys, so today I will be trying another heatless waves and this time I will be using socks. Now, I've actually tried curling your hair with uh, socks before. However, the technique that I used before included me putting a lot of clips on my hair and it wasn't really comfortable. But however, I have seen one of these techniques on TikTok using socks but without the clips. So that's exactly what I will be trying out today and see if that would actually work on my hair length because my hair is really really long. So, Alright, so for this I am not going to dampen my hair just because my hair is going to be inside the socks. So if my hair is damp, I'm pretty sure that it's not going to effectively dry my hair. Okay, so this is the socks that I will be using. Okay, so since I want bigger waves, I'm going to grab this much of the hair. Make sure that there are no tangles. And also I'm going to be working by sections since I have um, the shorter layers, right? Angle the socks just like this. And what I'll do just so that it will be easier for me to wrap my hair around the socks is I'm going to clamp my hair on top right there just to secure it and then just begin to wrap my hair around the socks just as if like I'm wrapping it around the barrel of the curling iron. And also if you guys notice, I'm actually laying the hair flat on the socks just so that I will have a really nice waves later. And also I'm keeping the hair um, really together, just like that with no spaces, just because I want the curls to, or the waves, to be more defined. Alright, so once you get here, they said you need to wrap your hair around it, like your hair around just like that. Oh my goodness. I don't think the socks is even that long to fit my hair. Okay, and then remove this clip right here. Okay, and in here, whatever is left here, I'm just going to insert that in there. I think I really need those knee-high socks. Oh, there we go. All right, okay. All right, so that's what it looks like right now. Um, that's one down. I am going to move on to the next layer. And also, by the way, if you guys are wondering, I'm using clean socks, okay? Because I know some people, they always say like, ew, you're using socks on your hair? I'm like, yeah, but it's clean. It's not dirty or anything, so it's totally fine. There you go. And then I'm just gonna work on this other side right here. All right, you guys, so this is what I look like right now. I'm gonna let this stay on my hair for, let's say, four hours and then after that I'm going to unravel it and show you guys the result. Alright you guys, so it has been several hours now and this one actually <laughs> kind of unraveled already but let's go ahead and see what it looks like. Oh, it's stayed. That's great. I really thought it's gonna unravel on the inside of the socks and all that. <laughs> I want to see if I like the formation of the waves. This is the only thing and my only issue when I do these types of curls is that um, if the fabric is not really um, soft for the hair, it has a tendency to do this. Like your hair actually is kind of ish stuck to it. Or is it just my hair? <laughs> oh, that's what it looks like. It actually looks like really soft waves. I do like it. It's it's just soft waves. It's not really the curls. Okay. Mostly, I think um, the part that really curled well is the bottom part. All right, so that's what it looks like on this side. I'm gonna go ahead and unravel the other side. From right here, it actually looks like my hair is like a wig. <laughs>
Um, to be honest, I actually like this side better than this side. And this is what it looks like on the other side as well. It's not bad except for, <laughs> except for my bangs. They're not really curled very well, but it's good. But overall, I do like the weights of my hair. Maybe next time I will try to curl it even more up here. But in order for me to do that, I will need to do more sections of my hair. So anyway, that's what it looks like. This has got to be probably one of my favorite no heat curls technique. Just because all you have to use is just socks. You don't necessarily need to put any hair ties or any of those butterfly clamps because sometimes they can be very uncomfortable. And also I do like the results of the waves as well because they look very natural. So that is it you guys. I hope you all like this video. And if you did, please give this video a thumbs up. And also let me know in the comments down below. I've actually have been seeing a lot of like heatless curls back again, especially on TikTok. Please do let me know if you all want me to try more heatless curls or heatless waves techniques. And don't forget to share this to your friend if you found this content valuable. And I'll see you on my next one. Bye!